Facebook has just released its LAMA, or the acronym for Large Language Model, Meta AI. Meta is formerly known as Facebook, and it has just released its latest AI in town. Instead of the ad foundational large model that can help researchers advance their work in the subfield of AI, LAMA is designed to be smaller and more performant than other large language models, making it easier for researchers without access to large amount of infrastructure to study these models. It is available in several sizes and a model card detailing how it was built has also been shared. The release of LAMA aims to democratize access to large language models and enable further research into improving their robustness and addressing issues like bias and toxicity. In this video, I have summarized the 10 points you need to understand about the Facebook Llama. So these are my top 10 points that you should pay attention to while using Llama. 10 points, okay? The first one is Llama has just been announced in February 24th of 2023. This was the official date of announcement. The second one is it was trained between December 2022 and February 2023, which means it is much more latest compared to a lot of other chatbots. Llama is available in several sizes, 7 billion parameters, 13 billion parameters, 33 billion parameters, and 65 billion parameters. This is because it requires far less computing power and resources to test new approaches, validate others' work, and explore new use cases. And the third point is Llama model card. Llama is sharing its Llama model card so that they can detail how do they build their model in order for them to keep with their approach of responsible AI practice. So they keep integrity and show to the world how everything is being done, at least in summary. So the Llama card is there. To help you with that number five is that llama 65 billion and llama 33 billion were trained on about 1.4 trillion tokens or about 1.4 trillion texts okay the llama 7 billion was trained on 1 trillion tokens so this is just to diversify everything not to have one ai tool that encompasses all this is for ease and specifications of products you can easily assign a given llama to a particular specific product and it will be trained specifically and deeply on that product. Number six is Llama trained with text from the 20 languages with the most speakers in the world. They use 20 languages to train this Llama technology. Number seven is that there is still more research needed to be done to address the risks of bias, toxic comments, and hallucinations in large language models. So more research is equally needed in case of Llama. Next one is it is non-commercial license at this point. In order to maintain integrity and prevent misuse, Facebook is releasing the Llama model under a non-commercial license to focus on research use cases only. Access to the model will be granted on a case-by-case -case basis. They've announced that access will be on case-by-case -case basis to academic researchers, those affiliated with organizations in government, civil society, and academia, and industry research laboratories around the world. So if you are interested in having access to this AI technology, you have to fill up a form which is available in the description. So you have to fill out this form to register uh, the link I have provided in the description. So that form can help you to indicate your interest, who are you and why do you need to use Llama. And if they find you worthy and you are among the key organizations they've highlighted, they will give you access to Llama and then you start using it for your own research and development. The results so far is Llama 13 billion parameters outperforms GPT-3, which is about 175 billion parameters on most benchmarks. And Llama 65 billion parameters is at the moment competitive with the best models like Chinchilla, which is 70 billion parameters, and the Google Spam E, which is about 540 billion parameters. So this is just general knowledge of what you should know about the Facebook Llama that had just been released. And more information can be found on Llama model card in the description. I'll put the link to the Llama model card. If you want to learn more about its model and how it is being, the details about it, you can click on that link and it will take you there. So at this point, I would like to sincerely appreciate you for being with me up to this point. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up. That means a lot to me. And please don't forget to hit the subscribe and notification buttons to stay connected to this channel for more and more videos like this. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.